Hello subscribers, uh, return viewers and new subscribers and new viewers. Uh, today is Sunday and uh, on Sunday we uh, look at, uh, we continue to explore and look at uh, the music of Pink Floyd. And we're looking at uh, latter day Pink Floyd or as I would call it uh, Gilmore Floyd. Not Pink Floyd but Gilmore Floyd. And there's quite, quite a lot of it here. I kind of thought to myself, hmm, just uh, be looking at a uh, momentary lapse of reason, uh, the division bell, the tree was uh, on vinyl and on CD, including uh, Endless River. I thought it'd be just those uh, five uh, albums on, on uh, both formats. And I said, ooh, <laughs> I forgot about the live ones. There's quite a lot here. A whole lot here. And um, not to be sniffed at. It is absolutely fantastic stuff here. I listened to this one uh, last night on uh, the Amazon Music Player. And it's just absolutely fantastic. It's, uh, it's a really, really good... Uh, if you want to get into... Uh, latter day uh, pink floyd this is a great place to start and then i would go with uh, the remastered edition of uh, delicate delicate sound of thunder there i've said it this one is very very muddy but if you're a completist like me you'll have it anyway uh the reason why i say this one it's uh this is uh just under an hour long this one is uh two and a half hours long and you have endless river the only thing I don't like about Endless River is the song at the end. It was largely an instrumental album, then the song comes at the end of it. It's kind of like the opposite of um, Final Cut, where uh, you have a tuneless rant, and then you have a song at the end of it. <laughs> and this is kind of an instrumental and a song at the end of it. So it's kind of a, ref a reflection of a kind of um, Final Cut if you will, kind of David Gilmore's uh, version of the final cut. Um, then uh, you have these two very good albums. I think the Division Bell stands above everything that is in um, David uh, Gilmore's uh, continuation of uh, Pink Floyd. I love these two albums up in the top, uh, Momentary Lapse. I love this version more so than this. The reason being is this is just a 1980s uh, David Gilmore solo album in disguise. This sounds more like a Pink Floyd album. And uh, I'm glad they really did a good uh, job on the remastering of it. Uh, the Division Bell is just a class, a classic album. And uh, I remember when it came out. I remember when these two albums came out. And I did buy them on CD back in the day. I'm, I, I'm not sure whether I ha have them on vinyl or not. I don't know. I think so. I think so. I think I have the Division Bell on vinyl. But I'm not 100% sure. Again, I'm trying to remember. Uh, you know, I have 300 albums on vinyl back home in Ireland. So <laughs> I'm trying to remember what I have. Uh, back, uh, you know, uh, that what I bought back in the day. Um, I would give all all, all this uh, wonderful uh, music. I'd give all of this a thousand percent. It's just a fantastic library of stuff to have, despite uh, the flaws of one or two of uh, two of the albums. You kind of like uh, me uh, moaning and groaning about them. Um, you know, uh, let it be in the uh, Abbey Road, but uh, you know, th this is the big picture here, and it is a uh, wealth, wealth of music and heritage that uh, we have here. And again, not to be sniffed at, and uh, you know, take your time and uh, you know, go surfing with this music, it is just a uh, just a uh, fantastic uh there's kind of i'm kind of almost out of words uh trying to describe what i see in front of me here 
it's just wow again i was kind of just thinking i'll have this lock to look at for this video and then it evolved into all of this and it's just wow <laughs> i'm kind of a little bit taken back by what i see in front of me and it's just uh it's just amazing just really really is amazing um i will be uh heading out into the wilds of somerset and i will be gathering some more pink floyd albums during the week and uh, if you've been paying attention to my other videos i i kind of given a clue as to what those albums will be so um stay tuned for uh next sunday's pink floyd uh music of pink floyd but yeah tell me what you uh what are what are your favorites among uh this uh s selection here this absolutely amazing um selection here i know there's uh the uh say it for me uh the later years box set and I think uh, I think all I'm missing out of that is uh, the Blu-ray of uh, Pulse. So uh, tell me if uh, you can tell me in the comments below if you have it. What do I need to add uh, to this collection? Uh, I probably will end up getting all of these live albums on CD on a hundred and eighty grams uh, vinyl. But um, I'm not in a hurry to get them. But uh, I will. When I go out hunt, record hunting, I will do so. And I'll pick them up. And, uh, you know, that's my hobby. That's my passion. And that's my interest. So I follow that. I follow that dream, as uh, Elvis would sing. So, uh, yeah, please let me know. What uh, do you think of uh, David Gilmore's uh, version of uh, Pink Floyd? And... Uh, if uh, you have them in your all these albums in your collection, even if you're not a fan. <laughs> okay, I've rambled on long enough. If you stuck out till uh, the end of this video, why thank you ever so much. Again, I'm kind of just wow. I'm kind of just shocked at uh, this selection of albums that I see before me. So again, thank you for sticking out uh, uh, to the end of this video. Um, you've been a fantastic audience. And we will talk to you again in the next video.